Just do a deep breath. Okay. And relax. Okay. Lay ankle. These are 16-year-old Ivan Chaban's first steps on his new prosthetic leg. And you can walk a little quicker if he likes. Why is not it stretch the extra hodges? Excellent. Beautiful. He's taking them in Mira Mesa with prosthetist Peter Harsh. But Ivan's home is a world away in Sumy, Ukraine, where he lives with his mother, two sisters, and two brothers. That's where, almost six months ago, his life changed forever. About a month after the Russian invasion, he, his mother, and stepfather were returning home from the grocery store when the evils of war struck their family. <laughs> Uh, as they were returning, he said, a column of uh, enemy Russian uh, vehicles uh, caught up to them, approached them. One of the tanks actually veered away from the column and uh, went directly towards them. And as the tank approached, uh, the other two were sort of shoved away and injured, and in his case, uh, the tank caught him under the tracks. Ivan's stepfather died in the attack. His mother survived, but Ivan lost part of his leg. Through it all, he still smiles. Були такі моменти, коли навіть шкода було, але не дуже. Ну, як потрібно жити далі та відпустити те, що сталося, вже нічого не повернути. I had a very positive attitude. His whole uh, reaction was, I want to live. The Ukrainian embassy in Washington, D.C., partnered with a San Diego-based Right to Walk Foundation to bring Ivan to the U.S. A family friend who came with Ivan says he wants to be fully mobile again to provide for his family. Life even up to this point was not easy for Ivan. Uh, uh, a large family uh, without a father. He is not uh, in any way negative or, or uh, sorry for himself. He is charging forward. And charging forward, he is. Go, go, go. Yep. Keep going, keep going. Push through. Yep. Go, go, go. Yep, yep. Look up. Nice and tall. Yep. There you go. Push, get those muscles going. Get Harsh says this journey won't be easy. Ivan will be here for the next three months, where he starts a foundation he can build on. And this place is different. They don't just work on the physical. Also the emotional stuff. As they're sitting here waiting, thinking about the family back home, what happened to them, is that we pick them back up so they can go again to the next level. Anybody can make Ivan walk. But can they take them to the next level, the level they need to really go back and do their life? This is what people need to think about, and this is not easy. But even Harsh is impressed with Yvonne's first day on his prosthetic leg. He'd only been measured for it the day before. Does he want one more? Feel good to walk? Ask him. Yeah, he can send it back to his mom and tell her he's walking. Second day. Ivan has big dreams. Uh, go to Hollywood. Uh, yeah. Uh, be an actor. Right. With your optimism and your courage, I think you can do anything you want to do. Dream big. Ivan still needs a local host family to help him through his recovery so he can make his dream a reality. Kitty Alvarado, KPBS News.